Hi guys and welcome to Brighton. Apparently we've been called to assist in an incident. Yes, welcome to East Coastway and uh, cut enclosure scenario and welcome to the stream guys. Like we're on uh, Dovetail again. Dovetail invited me back. We're going to jump in this class 66 and we're going to set it up. Hopefully. Uh, I'm fully trained. Fully trained, yeah. We're going to set up the lead locomotive. So we're going to navigate to this using the arrows. Right, okay. So, uh, yeah, that's it. Brake cut out there. Then press that one. Then press that one. Then we're going to head to the other end of the train. Yeah, okay. Climb down there. I'm going to leave the door open because I know we've got to come back. I mean, no one's going to nick a Class 66. I mean, it's a secure. Look, we've got a wall. It's fine. Nobody's going to break in and nick, nick a train. We're good. Should we, should we up there? Oh, hang on. No, I thought that was a climby one. There's a climby one. There you go. We can climb up there looking for the cab. Isn't that cool? Walking to the post slim. Got a sign there that says stop. Telephone signaler. It's a good train. There's another train there, that. I think that's an EMU. I think that's an electric one. Right, we're going to jump on board this guy. Open that. Jump in here. And we're going to do the same here. Right, so set the isolation switch. Pop the master key in. Uh, we're going to do the brake cut out again. So, oh, there. Hold on. Then there. Then there. And then hopefully this gauge will move. Is it going to move? It's moving! It's moving! I did a thing! It worked! Oh yes! It's, it's, it's good when it works. I usually break things, you see. Especially when it comes to trains. I'm good at breaking trains. There we go. I can release that now. So now we need to do the cut out. There you go. And then flick that back to the main menu. I need to take my key out. And we're going to go back to the other one. Um, I like to do this by doing that to make sure the door closes. Right, I'll have the shift to run. Assuming you're on the PC, of course. Oh, we can turn the handbrakes on. Look at that. Run down here. No tripping over the hazards. There's always trip hazards you got to watch for. I'm up there. I think we're going to stay in this one now, so I'm going to close the doors. I might be wrong. We're going to pop the isolation switch on, engine run switch on, generator field switch on, control fuel pump on, master key in, set that to forward. Uh, we're going to do this again. Hang on. Exit the current to the main menu. Yeah. Uh, hold the brake release again. Excellent. We can do that. The needles are moving. That's always a positive sign. Positive pressure, that is. Peer pressure. Can we give a bit of peer pressure to Dovetail? Put in chat what you'd like to see in Train Sim World. Like, just give them a bit of peer, peer pressure. And then we've got to contact the signaler. There we go. Proceed at restricted speed. No problem. We can do that. We're moving. We're moving. It's a result. Now, I haven't worked out. I've worked out where the, uh, the wipers are. We can put those on. Which is good. But I haven't worked out how to turn the lights on. Uh, I'm sure they're probably in there somewhere. Brake timing, English metric, train car, no. Maybe not. I don't know. I haven't worked that out. I have worked out that we can have fresh air. Yeah. But I have no idea. Oh, I wonder if there's switches. Ah, here we go. Cab lights. There we go. Cab lights on. Death lights on. Instrument lights on. Let's have that. Tail lights We should do, but I'm not going to. Oh, look at that. That's way better now. I can see what I'm doing. There we go. I've worked out where the lights are. Brake test. No. I won't put my headlights going on this way because I know that we've got to turn around in a minute. So, like, spoiler. Spoiler alert. We're going to be going the other way. I don't know quite why. Because I had a quick go just to make sure I could turn the engine on and move it. Like a pretest, because it's been a while since I've I've 
driven a 66. It's been a little while. I thought I'd better have a quick 10 minute test refresher to load up and uh, make sure I can move and make sure I can stop it. I, I like to do that just before I start recording. And then, I, well, I, I kind of do a little record as well, do a sound check. Always good. If you if you want to become a streamer, always do a sound check first. Make sure you've got sound. Especially if you use OBS Studio, because it has a tendency of uh, <laughs> not doing the sound. So I like to do audio checkups before we start. Make sure everything's recording. Have a quick look back. Now, I'm not very good with the brakes in this thing. Apply the brake. It applies a certain amount of pressure, I think. All right, release the brake. A little bit of power. I want to get to the end. I haven't turned my wiper off. Sorry. A little bit of power. See, professional I am. Sneaking along. I mean, we don't need to go to the end of the platform, to be fair. I'm just trying to make it look good. Here we go. A little bit more. About there, do. How do. Six yards. That's close enough. Right. Shut down the locomotive. Put it into neutral. Yeah. Uh, get that back up to five bar, apparently. There we go. We gotta set it to break cut out, yeah. Set it to cut out, yeah. Head to the, well we've got to take the key, haven't we? I would have fault. Then we're gonna go out this door. Oop, hang on. Open that door. Close that one. Jump down there. This is as far as I've got. Alright. Hello people! Uh, I'm a very important person. Oh, you look like you're going to an interview. He looks like he's a tax inspector. I'm just saying. He does look like a tax inspector. We're going along there. That looks like 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 your sister-in-law or something, maybe. I like to categorise people. Uh, there's the door there. All right. Why not that? I'm, I'm guessing we're going to stay in here now. So I'm going to close the doors behind me. Jump in here. Flick the rest of these on. So engine run. That, that, that. Pop. Oh, hang on, I didn't mean to get out of the chair. Press the wrong button there. Doo -doo -doo. Pop that in there. Uh, yeah, we're on the cutout menu up there, look. So we can press that. And we can cut it in. And then we can go back to the main menu. Set that to full. Oh, no, hang on. Set that to forward. And then when the signal permits, where well, it's green, I'm going to say it's permitting. You forgot to tell me to do the brake thing. I'll do the brake thing. Hang on. We need some brake pressure. Or did I miss it? I might have missed it. Here we go. Right, that one's got to go to zero. And we're moving. We're moving. I did a thing. It worked. Makes a change. I have released the brakes, haven't I? Yes. There we go. We're good. Look at this. Yeah, we're all good. Right, let's get a move on. We've got 5.3 miles to go. We can do this. Oh, I've got to put my wipers back on, haven't I? Is it still raining? I suspect. Yeah, it's raining still. Look. It's only a shower. I'm not going to put that one on because we've not got anybody sat next to us. Here we go. Oh yeah, I was going to put my lights on. Hang on. I forgot to turn my lights off on the other end. Instrument lights, tail lights, yeah. And then we're going to put no, daytime headlights. There we go. If I go outside now, we should have headlights. There we go. We've got one headlight. One's better than none. Yeah, no, that's good. That's about best I can do. 
<laughs> I'm still learning, all right? Even though I've played literally virtually every single scenario that there's been, I'm still learning the controls of all the trains. I know, I've got a very terrible memory, all right? And get 30 mile an hour, we can do it. Oh, well, 25 there, but we, we go, we're going up to a 30 limit, and then we're going to go up to a 35 limit. We're on a flat. We're on a, we're on a what's his name, a viaduct. There we go. Apply more power. Does look good. Oh, especially on there. Look at that. Press F1. I can hide the UI. Take a screenshot of that. I like that. 35 over 55. That means. Possibly. Oh, train station. Do a little bit of the horn. Let people know I'm coming through. Stand back from the platform. You don't want to be like the wind to pull you off of the train platform. Because we're going fast. Not. Right, 4.8 miles. We can do this. Yes. I, I'll tell you one thing that I do want added to trains in world. It's track IR. I said it last time. One day I'm going to get my wish and they're going to do it. They're going to add it one day, I'm sure. And then we can all go, ooh, I can move my head. Because that'd be cool. Because I'm moving my head now and it's not doing anything. Ooh, had a bit of slippage then. What was that about? I reckon there were some leaves on the line. <laughs> That's our greatest excuse in British in the British Railway Network yes leaves are on the line you're gonna have to go I know I know you paid 30 quid to go on the train today but you're going on a coach and it's gonna take you three times longer sorry about that yes oh I've got a train journey coming up I'm going up to EGX rest if it doesn't get cancelled as long as it doesn't get cancelled, somebody rumoured it to me the other day. I don't know if that's false news, but they rumours that it might get cancelled. I hope not, because I'd like to go there. I went last year and it was good fun, and I met up with a load of fans. So uh, it'd be nice to do it again. Like, if you see me up there, wave. Well, you can come up and say hello. I don't mind. But yeah, oh, another station. Right, we can do 45 here. Let's get some speed on. Give it some welly. There you go. We need some more, like, characters in game as well, don't we? Like, standing on the platforms. A few more added. I don't think we've had any added since launch. That would be nice. And what's our... Look at that one. Yeah, look at that one. Oh, hang on. Gotta cut the power. I'm over speeding. Buy a little bit of brake. Then release it. Don't want to go too fast. We're not doing too bad. I want a little bit quick there. I do get enthusiastic sometimes. Push the train past the limits. But we're on track to get there on time. There we go, about there. I want one more mile an hour, but then I know I'm going to overspeed. Because it'll go 46. There you go, 45. Bang on. Just flick it between throttle three and four, I reckon. And that'll keep us roughly... Oh, hang on. We're going up We're going up hill now a little bit. Got a little bit of a gradient. One percent. Have to apply a bit more power, that means. Power! All right. It's all 35 coming up. Oh, no. We're all right. We've got, we've got 1.6 miles.
Just feathering the throttle, I like to call this. Yes. I, I tried the um, Oakville subdivision last week. That was good. I like that. That's that's all horn. Coming through the station. Everybody stand back. Slim's coming through. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I tried the uh, Oakville subdivision. That's a that's a nice DLC. That if you want a challenge, if you want a challenge. I tell you, I struggled a bit on that one, but I did it. Managed it. Well, I've done one so far. By the time you watch this, I might have done another one. I probably would have done another one. Maybe even three. Ta -da. There we go. In a tunnel. I should really have the wipers off in the tunnel. Don't know where the rubber bit out on them. There we go. I can see we're doing a little bit too fast. I'll slow her down. Okay. Wipers back on. All right, we got to slow down in a bit. So let's cut the power. Now it's down to 35. A little bit early. A little bit early. Smidge off. There we go. That's because I'm doing it early because I'm not very good on the brakes in this thing. Because they, you kind of, you you apply it and then it applies pressure up to wherever you press it and release it, and then it stays at that pressure and then you're gonna release it. So you can like, it's almost like putting your foot on a on the brake pedal to a certain point. But then you release it, to, and but the brake pedal stays at that point. And of course, I didn't realise we sped up again then, because we're going downhill. So you probably want to keep a little bit of brake pressure on, maybe. Ooh, now I've slowed it down too much. But we're getting close to our destination, and we've got to stop up here. Because like I've got to ignore the top right now because it's saying 1.7 miles to 35 mile an hour limit, which is correct. But we're going to stop in 0.8 miles. Let's just smidge on the brake a bit. So you can see down there, these ones moving basically. These two here. If you see, I apply it, goes up a bit. So, like, we're on 0.5 bar brake pressure. And then, if I release it, it goes down to zero. See? See, I'm training you all in how to drive a Class 66. <laughs> if you're gonna, if you're gonna accept me as your training person, as your coach. You're putting your lives in your hands, that's all I gotta say. Okay, we're gonna stop here. This is stop at the signal. It's, I mean, it's a green signal. That. Just a smidge more. We're going to stop there. He says. Start slowing her down a bit more. Buy more brake pressure. Bleaker out. Have we got to go and talk to those people? About there, dude. 
And there you go, four yards. That's not bad, is it? Right, we've reached the incident site. Stop the train and close as close to the land side as permitted. And we'll aid with this. Right, okay, so we've got to move forward, have we? Okay, I'm assuming. Let's release the brakes. Here we go. Right, stop at location. We've got 1.2 miles. A little bit of power. There you go. You should wear a hat, mate. Keep your head dry. Just saying. I know, I know you're working. You can't have an umbrella. That, that would be silly. But you, you definitely need a hat on. Here we go. I'm concentrating. I go quiet when I concentrate, by the way. Don't panic. I'm still here. I'm just... I've, I've got to watch my speed. I mean, we can go a little bit faster. We're still a mile away. It's fine. I'm sure they won't begrudge us that. Sneak, which is, this is a sneak attack. Oh no, wait, they know we're coming. There's our third rail, by the way. I don't know if I want to slow down just yet. We've still got 0.9 of a mile. Start slowing her down a bit. Get her down to about 20, I reckon. There we go. Down to 20. We've still got to slope down the hill. We've got a yellow light. That's alright. We can go through that. It's not going to fail us. The landslide, apparently, around the corner. Have a little bit of break on to keep us steady. 900 yards to go. We're nearly there. Oh, was that a car going under there? I think it was. Yep, yeah, there's a look, car's going under the bridge. Gotta have the place lived in. I remember that was one of the criticisms originally. Was they didn't seem lived in. And they've done well at addressing that. And there's more trains moving about and stuff. Coming up 600 yards. Slow down a little bit more. Going up, we're still under the speed limit. I don't know what half the track signs mean. You guys will know. What does that 10 mean? Like, put it in chat now. That adds two arrows. Start slowing her down a bit. Oh, yeah, look. There's, oh, that's not good. We've got to get to there. There's been a bit of slippage, a bit of slide. All right, here we go. Start applying those brakes. Out there, Adima. There we go. Here we go. Right, what are we going to do next? I haven't done this bit yet. We stopped. Is it going to give us instructions? What does it say there? Stop. Oh, hang on. Climb down, and I got to report. I got. I got. Hang on. Right. I'd just like to mention, mate. Uh, it's raining.
Yes. Oh, we finished. Woo! I thought we would have to drive forward or something. Okay. That wasn't too bad, was it? We went over a couple of times. I say we, right? Because it's mostly your fault in chat. It's obviously not mine, right? I mean, whoever streams next, if they go over the speed limit, right, put an F in chat. Like, whoever's video's up next, like, spam it in chat. We'll do that. It'd be funny. It will. Um, we got a gold medal there. So we did all right. We got some points and stuff. That was fun, wasn't it? If you've liked it, then, like, let, let them know in the comments below. Anyway, that's your lot for today, guys. So until the next time, it is goodbye from me, Slim. Till the next time. Bye-bye.